Another threat in the halls of a Billings High School leads to an arrest and an intimidation charge. School resource officer and the administration acted quickly to find that student early Wednesday afternoon. After three credible school threats, much is occupying the mind of Superintendent Greg Upham this week. We take every one of them seriously and we follow them to the nth degree. The most recent one was Wednesday at Senior High School at around 12.30. A posting had been made in the, from a bathroom uh, that talked about a school shooting uh, the next day. Upham says the school resource officer quickly determined who posted the message by using school surveillance video. We look at what time it was posted. You go into our, we look at our surveillance, says who was in the bathroom at the time, when did it come out at the time, who was the originator of, the, of sending the messages, and so that's where you start. He says police arrested a sophomore male student. I'm not specific to the internal components to that, but um, they feel that the individual that they have at least uh, is, a, is a person who sent the posts as far as the, the originator of the post. Um, I believe they're confident. I just can't speak to it directly. The first threat came last week after a hate symbol was drawn in a restroom stall at West High School. Then on Tuesday, an additional hint at a shooting in the stall of a girl's restroom at West. The superintendent says about 1,300 out of nearly 2,300 West students, or close to 60 percent, chose not to go to school on Wednesday. It's very similar to what we had at West. Yeah, that threat was a school shooting that was to occur on December 7th, which was located the week before and so very similar. Some of the posts on Facebook say they need to know that this is serious and my kids aren't going to school tomorrow. Upham says the threat mentioned this would happen on Thursday and with the person responsible arrested, he doesn't believe senior students will skip school. But every family and every individual handles this differently. Um, but I feel safe that school is open tomorrow and will run uh, appropriately and, and we'll just keep working through this one day at a time. In Billings, David J, MTN News.